Hello everyone. Today we've encountered an issue with our APC UPS unit, SRT5000 via model. I'm trying to access the APC UPS webpage, but it seems like something's gone wrong, so we will diagnose and solve the problem. So first of all, we will check our UPS network setting and confirm everything is okay. So first press escape button, press down arrow button, and press OK on configuration. Then press down and find the communication, and then press OK, then go to network. Press down button to see your manual IP address of your APC. You can change the IP address of your UPS and give it manual according to your network setting. I already put my IP address so no need to change anything. So let's jump right into my computer and troubleshoot the issue together. Before we move forward, make sure you have connection of your APC via a local console cable or through local network connection. In this video, we will access it through local network connection. So let's jump into the computer screen. So I am on my computer. First go Windows and type CMD and press Enter. Then ping the IP address of UPSCU. So we are getting the ping result successfully. It means our APCUP is connected with our router. So let's go to browser, open new page and type in URL, IP, address of your UPS. There we go, an error. It looks like the page isn't loading. It seems the problem might be specific to the APCUPS web page. So we will open a PC command line interface using PuTTY application. Open PuTTY application. Type your APC, IP address, and make sure you select SSH and then click open. It will connect using SSH connection. Here we see the login screen. Now type a PC default login, a PC and password, a PC123. See after you log in you can check if ATPP is disabled or enable. It is showing web interface port on our APC. Currently disabled. This means we can't access it through a web browser. Now we will unable it using this command. Type web H enable and press enter. You will see success showing that previous command run successfully. Then type reboot and press enter. Now type yes. It will save the configuration and enable the web interface. Now internet interface connection is rebooting, so we will wait a while. It will take 30 seconds to start. UPS is online now. We can check if our web page is working or not. Okay, that's it. We got the web connection from a PC UP. See how you can log in with same username and password. That's it for today video, and if you have any question you can tell in comment section. If you like the video don't forget to hit the like button, and subscribe for more upcoming videos.